and gentlemen, it is uh, the 29th today. Uh, welcome to Shanghai and uh, welcome to another segment of you get to watch me eat stuff. Mm -mm. You get to watch me eat different things. Um, so, Shanghai, uh, Shanghai food is famous for its sugar content. It's uh, supposed to be very sweet. So I'm gonna go to one of the uh, pastry shops over here and uh, look at what they have. I actually already bought some stuff, so I'm not gonna buy anything, but here's the, some of the items they have. So Shanghai is uh, famous for its traditional pastry, but it's not just pastry that they're famous for. Like, supposedly everything they eat is very sugar high. And I don't know how that works, but I wouldn't want my uh, regular chicken or beef with, to be filled with uh, sugar and sweets, but I don't know. We'll see. I already bought some of the stuff. Uh, they are, uh, I'll, show you guys, I'll show you guys in a bit. Uh, let me just walk down the street. So the goal today is to find uh, I don't know what they call it. The outlet that they sell train tickets. So Oh, here's the cell phone. I don't know. They're, they're selling cell phone numbers. I don't know. I'm not sure why they're selling cell phone numbers. I'm not sure the reasoning behind it. Uh, they just are. There's a lot of... This is like one of their... There's not even a main street. It's like one of the, uh, I don't know. It's not even there downtown, but it's ridiculously busy. So I'm just walking down the road looking like an idiot holding a camera. Uh, people are looking at me funny. But, it's all right, I have no shame. So, uh, the situation is this. Chinese, they have a holiday, a national holiday called the uh, May 1st holiday where they get uh, three days of uh, nothingness. It's kind of like their spring break, but uh, like half spring break because it's only three days. Um, so the Chinese students and workers and whatnot, they will use this three days to either go back to their family or go to um, uh, you know, go vacationing. So, I'm gonna have to buy a train ticket before uh, the whole like holiday rush starts. Otherwise, I'll never ever get a train ticket. The uh, Australian couple who was, shares my room uh, are not so lucky. They uh, couldn't get a train ticket, so they actually have to buy plane tickets to get out of this place. Yeah, uh, I actually have a Australian couple in my uh, in my uh, dormitory, and um, their plan is to go all the way. No, from starting from Australia, I go all the way north, traveling through several countries like island hopping, plane hopping, and go all the way to uh, Russia. Then go f across Russia to like Greece, and eventually get to Germany for Oktoberfest. So, you know, I applaud them for that. The couple pretty much threw away all they had, like, you know, quit their jobs and leave their families and... I don't know, some call it insane, but, uh, I applaud them for that. I applaud them for their courage. Um, you know, I should be eating this thing, but you guys are keeping me from eating my stuff. So... I don't know where the, uh, I was told it's this way, but, uh, let me ask some random people on the street. Uh, all right, he uh, signals me to go ahead. It's a giant dog in the alley. Oh, that dog's huge. I'm easily distracted. 
All right. I'm gonna find this train ticket spot and ask if I could buy a train ticket and leave this goddamn place. So the thing with Shanghai is very, very windy, as you can see. It's a coastal city. It's a lot of sea breeze. So even though it's very sunny, it's not really all that hot, which is a good thing because I don't like hot weather. Um, on first glance, and I just noticed that Shanghai is very much like Taiwan, or Taipei, or a mixture of cities from Taiwan. You know, you have the modern, and you have the old, and you have like traditional people and uh, younger folks dressed in flashier colors, and people very busy going about their business. Um, so it feels like at home and I think one way that's a good thing but in another way it is very unexciting for me which is bad. I want things to be exciting. So I really can't wait to get out of here. So not that I don't like this place. This place is nice, it's just, I don't know, don't have much allure. Uh, so the plan for later today is that, um, oh, there's a train ticket uh, booking office for the train. All right. Uh, some people I meet, some people I met in the hostel, and they told me that they have extra uh, football game tickets for those in uh, North America, the soccer game tickets. So apparently Chinese soccer, like the team sucks and they don't do very well, but I don't know, it's a free ticket, so whatever. I'm gonna check it out. I've never been to a soccer game before, so it'll be my first. I'll pop my cherry in China. I don't know if I can film myself buying a ticket would that be like violation of some ethic code of like an apology because i don't i didn't ask them who knows but if they yell at me i'll just say no okay fine maybe i can whoa the wind is so windy look at this look at this look at this wind crazy Oh, somebody is inside. Let me sit out here and eat. Yeah, you guys get to watch. Oh, look at this. So I bought two different things. This is a fa gao. So this is pretty much like sugar. Uh, let me let me read the contents. Sticky rice, white sugar, uh, bean paste, and grease. All right, sounds nice. Grease. Well, it's better than grease than lard, right? Oh, this is well the same thing. White sugar. I mean, sticky rice, white sugar, bean paste, and grease. Uh-oh. Ah! I don't know how this... I'm gonna hold the camera and eat at the same time. This is gonna be difficult. Let me try this.
now like everyday food we only have these in like Chinese New Year's these are like Chinese New Year food but apparently Shanghai is their pastry specialty there are three people sitting over there well sitting over there arguing with the uh with the ladies on the train tickets I don't know I hope I don't have to argue with her I'm not very good at arguing so, I, I think I'm gonna make another film later today when I'm at the uh, soccer game I've never been to a Chinese soccer game or any Chinese sport event uh, we'll see we'll see how that goes maybe even go to the bar later I think um, a bunch of us are going to the bar later so we're gonna be up to some shenanigans shenanigans I don't know this thing doesn't really wow me but it's not bad no it's good for snack I fear I'm not losing very much weight I feel like I'm not losing very much weight either oh what's the time Two more minutes. No. I don't think I don't think you guys will get to see me um, buy plane tickets. But I'm not doing that sweep. So um, here are the streets. So instead of um, you guys watch me stuff my face with pastry. Actually, just one. Hmm. All right, my turn. I shall buy um, for the bill from Shanghai to Guangzhou. Huh? Zhi Hao, um, this week, Monday, is there? Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. 对广州。到广州到广州多少？啊？到广州还是广州多？嗯，我要去佛山，我不知道。佛山。啊，佛山。佛山佛山这一种什么？佛山的话。你买什么买粥啊，买物啊？呃，都可以，哪一个便宜的做哪一个。大概价钱差多少？价钱都差不多的。价钱都差不多啊。那你不行就买一张座位的。对，价钱都差不多的话，那当然买座位的了。好吧。两百一十三。两百一十三。给一桶。行。到到佛山了。啊、呃，对，到佛山。是到佛山，不是到广州啊。呃，没有，我对我亲戚在佛山，就是去佛山吧。那你买了火车的，早上九点四十一开车。早上九点十一，那么早？九点四十一开车。九点四十一。对，到第二天早上七点半到。哦，好行。嗯。好像来上海就要吃糕点的样子。啊？我说好像来上海就要吃糕点。为什么？糕点好吃啊？上海不是要吃甜食吗？<笑>对。你二十块没有啊？哎，我刚打了，应该有，我看看，不好意思，嗯，好像真的没有啊，五十块钱不行，五十块，五十块钱，你把它还给你了啊，嗯。Here are my tickets to Four Shine. Alright, there you go. That will be all. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the video.